This is Sparta! We are here at Croft Park and the players are coming out onto the pitch. It's Fly Spartans against the FC United of Manchester here live on RadioThumbnail.com. It's Johnny Hawk alongside Mark Carruthers. And Croft Park is absolutely bouncing for this game. By Thomas Greaves. A long tall towering throw and I'm here it's looking and looking for Nathan Buttle Buttle wins the header and Norton tries to get his header well on it with a kind of grand stands up to it well a bit of just over seven minutes gone as uh, Callum Bird looks to swing this free kick in it's going to be helped on left in the end it's going to be hit by Callum Bird it's over Conor Grant's goal good pressure from Maguire Trying to put uh, David Carnell under pressure. It's going to be flicked on into the battle of Greaves. Greaves leaves it for Norton. Norton's running down on goal. Got Danny Parker and Nathan Buttle trying to slow him down. He helps it back on for Thomas Greaves. Greaves on the edge of the box. Greaves is going to have a strike across goal. And now uh, it's going to be turned past the post by Conor Grant. Yeah, good effort there from, uh, from Greaves again. The danger man. Grant clears this ball long, looking for Robbie Dale again. Dale wins the header again, tries to figure out to Robinson. He won't quite come in. He'll go back to Dale, though. Dale, he falls to Robinson in the end after a header from uh, Adam Jones went wandering. Robinson will play the first goal. It comes off Lee Neville. Could have went absolutely anywhere. Good effort there from Robinson, probably 20, 22 yards out and uh, deflected just over his bar there. Robinson's going to take the corner. He's decided where he wants to put it. Spartans players in the middle, quite a crowded area. Swings it across goal, across comes Danny Parker. That was a great corner in. Comes back only as far as Robinson. He's not challenged, has a chance to play it across goal again. Oh. And uh, it took another deflection, and it's another corner. Suddenly, Blind are coming to life. That will clear. Won't quite come to uh, Maguire. It falls here for Hooks. Hooks into the feet of Dale. Dale looks to set away Robinson. Robinson is Dean Stotts trying to close him down. He skips away from Stotts. Robinson will try and swing a ball onto his right. We'll put a cross in. It's going to come all the way through to Dan McGuire. It's going to fall here to Wimmo! Over the bar. Half chance for Spartans. Yeah. But, uh, he was always backing off there. Falls to Dale. Dale just tries to flick it on for uh, Dan McGuire. A nice little idea, but it doesn't quite come off. And Neville should be able to clear. But Good Dale's going to back from Neville. And suddenly Dale's in on the edge of the box. Tries to play it across here. But Dan McGuire, good goalkeeping from Carnell. Yeah, not the greatest ball in for Robbie Dale then. <laughs> McGuire just couldn't get in front of his man to finish it. Pure with a bit of space to run into. We'll backtrack a little bit and leave it for Hooks. Hooks oh, what a ball. Pure has a great, good ball and Pure was in. Pure oh, was trying to have some sort of a strike at the near post. But uh, the goalkeeper wasn't going to be beaten from there. Connor will clear this ball long. It's offside. Looks so Greaves is offside. The flag doesn't go up though. And then comes Wolfenden. Wolfenden across. Goal! And FC United take the lead at Croft Park. Claims of an offside, not given. And Wolfenden came across and just placed the ball across Conor Grant. And with 26 minutes to go, FC United lead by a goal to nil. Robinson looks to swing this corner in. It's going to come all the way to the edge of the box for Hooks. Hooks is going to hit it. Header from Arsham. Oh. Oh, well. And it's just over the bar. Disappointed defeat, but a great performance, I thought, after so many away trips. Yeah, we're very disappointed. Everybody's good to have lost a game. Um, in terms of the performance, it's been a lot better than I, I think the last four games we've huffed and puffed. But today we we had a go with what we had available, and and I think that's been the telling factor that you know when we pick up a couple of injuries in this squad, it's very light. Um, but all credit to the lads who had a go because we did. 
And I looked, it was a, a real physical game, but I thought that the centre backs again were, were really immense today. Yeah, I mean, Danny and Buddle had just get better and better. Um, a little bit disappointed with the service that Nipper got because it was non-existent. It was all in the air. Um, the centre half set it all up. He never got a, a sniff to deer. But when you're as good as Nipper, that starts to happen. The teams will come and they'll double up on you, and you know he he's got to get through that. And we look at Tuesday now. Ashton here, massive game, the Senior Cup, and really a big prize at the end of that. Well, it is, and um, we we said at the start of the season that we wanted to win the Senior Cup. That was one of the priorities of the season to win the Senior Cup. I still think we can do it. We'll be going all out to do it. But in terms of the playoffs, I mean, Ashton's Ash, Ash, lost today. Skelmers Dale's lost today. It's really, it's as we were really. Right, Nathan, a disappointing result today. Yeah, definitely. I think uh, we approached the game right. You know, we got at them first t uh, 20 minutes straight in the faces and they knew them for a game. And to be honest, I think it was just that one one chance they managed to get and they managed to score from it, which it's disappointing, but, you know, um, they, they, uh, they're at the top for a reason. So hopefully we move on Tuesday night now. And just on Tuesday, a big chance to get a final at St James's. It's a big game, isn't it, here? Definitely. I think, you know, we've played really well all season. I think that's the least we deserve. So I think last time we were a little bit naive going in against Ashton, which we shouldn't have been, but we know what to expect this game. And I'm sure we'll, uh, we'll we'll definitely be up for it. And if we just look to the rest of the season, obviously the playoff challenge, as we are just saying, off there, the results have gone our way. And is there a chance of that playoff spot? Definitely. Um, you know, if we keep on playing like we can, keep on winning, um, you know, we could either be there or thereabouts. It's, it's just like what we're saying, you know, when, when we slip up, they slip up and it's, it's always, you know, we're, we're clinging on. So hopefully the results go away next weekend. We manage to get the win and you never know.